running for her life. Ana Fidelia Quiroz was born March 23, 1963 in the US Cuba. But the time she was 10 years old, she used to run very fast, often with her shoes. She practiced hard every day. A 13 she had a place a government sports school. Later she started to train with Blas Beato, one of Cuban's most famous running teachers. In 1987, she won two gold medal at the Pan American Games in Indianapolis, in the U.S. And in 1989, she won all her 800 medal race. Anna was very proud to reign for her country. Her name was famous around the world. On January 23, 1993, Anna was washing some clothes in a large bowl on top of a stove. She carefully ideally a call to the washing, but some alcohol fell onto the stove in second fire cover Anna's body. But once covered 38% Anna's body and she was closer to death. Fidel Castro was painting on her recovery. Only a month after her accident, she began walking around inside the hospital, and after two months, she was running. Anna spent five long months there. Slowly, she became stronger, training with pain and sadness every day, and she refused to stop fighting. She was in her 13th now. In 1993, the San years as her terrible accident, she ran at the Central American and Caribbean Games in Puerto Rico. She wasn't able to move her arms and get easily at this time. Anna won a silver medal in the 800 medal range. In 1995, Anna was running international. She won the gold medal for 800 medals in the World Games in Stockholm, Sudan. She was one of the faster women in the world again. At 33 years old, Anna was often the oldest woman in her race. In 1996, in the Olympic Games in Atlanta, US, she called reigns against the world best runner. Anna Kiros fighting against Pine in an example of courage for us all. Created using Powtoon.